Auckland to Maravidwe Guampa. He receives his thousand rand. Thank you to Hollywood Bets and Cape Racing. Jockey aboard was uh, Craig Zaki, and uh, most certainly, Craig, you, um, I think, forming this beautiful bond with Dean Canamani's horses, and the results are coming through. Yeah, they're definitely starting to come through nicely. Um, all the horses are needing their first and some of them their second run. So now that they're getting those runs out the way, they're starting to um, find, their, find their legs and we're starting to find a rhythm and it's going well. I think with regards to that, Bright Duchess most certainly fits that build. So third run after rest and she seems to be quite progressive in her form. Yeah, she's progressing the right way. Um, she's a filly who could be a little bit keen on the day, but with racing, she's, she's starting to mature and settle down nicely. And, Look, I liked her a bit last time, but she was drawn 11 out of 11, and it was always going to be hard with the way the track was running. Today we found a little bit of a better draw, and she found a nice spot, and we knew um, if things had gone away, she'd, she'd be a massive runner, and she's, she's obliged. With regards to how she, she finished the race, were you quite impressed by that? I was. Um, she made that inside run, and just after the turn, she sort of like ducked out from those boards. So she's obviously still green, and still has improvement to come, but... What I like most is she sort of got in balance at about the 150, but she's quick to find her feet, and she actually got going again at the line, which is encouraging, because um, hopefully in the soon future she she can go a little bit of a more of a trip. Well done, Craig. Thank you. Just well done to Mr. Kinnaman and his team. Um, great job all the guys back at home. Well done to Mrs. Rupert, to Kevin uh, on course, and to my sponsors, Mary Spinton and Volker Thank you. Well done, Craig. Thank you. Next up, Dean Kaname is going to come across and uh, chat to us. And this is uh, always nice to get one onto the board earlier on. And uh, Dean, with regards to uh, your run, is a similar comment in relation to what I'd said to Craig is that you sort of building this good and he said the, the, the rhythm is uh, sort of coming to hand. Yeah, it's all coming together. And um, it's Philly, you know, she was better drawn today. She was drawn six. Last time she was drawn 11. And it's tricky, you know, the course is so fast and firm at the moment. So um, he got in a nice, comfortable position and she switched off. and. Uh, and she he stuck to her guns, you know, a little bit of, you know, in the last 100 metres change his stick, and, uh, but she fought more, she pegged that it was back. So I'm very excited and, and good luck to, to Gaino, uh, Rupert, you know, Darkenstein and, and the whole team. You know, she's a uh, half-sister to also, or Bright Green, which I haven't seen much of. Was that that uh, started his career very well and we had some issues, so we haven't seen much of him. But he's on his way back uh, to getting him on the race course. So, uh, well done, Kevin, as I said, in the team, and it was a really gutsy perform. But she's tough, you know. She also had a few issues that took some time to get over. and uh, But uh, she's, she's sound, and uh, it was a gutsy win today. It was indeed. Well done to you and your team. Uh, thank you, Vicky. Thank you very much. There you go. Thank you very much. Drakenstein stud, uh, lovely represented by Kevin Somerville. Kevin, well done. No, thank you very much, Vicky. Um, you're obviously, congratulations to Gaynor. Um, yeah, the Phillies really knuckled down and, uh, you know, put her head down where it mattered most. So, um, yeah, very nice one. And obviously thanks to Dean and his whole team and, and Craig, who I thought rode a lovely race. Kevin, with regards to the, our sort of summer racing season, this almost begins to be the turning point. Um, but a lovely day for, for Drakenstein Stud today. Yeah, it's obviously exciting. I mean, it's... it's um, you know, um, Greg uh, was able to have us around very kindly um, last week at Kenilworth, and I think we all can't wait to get back there. Um, place is going to look spectacular and very, very excited for the for the summer season. Um, but today's racing is full of class, and there's plenty of really good horses on, on track. So yeah, excited to see how we can get on, and, you know, hopefully we can get lucky enough and, and, and maybe win one of the major races. Well done for the win here. To you and Drakenstein. Thank you. Thank you, Vicky. Well done to Kevin Somerville and representing Drakenstein Stud. Uh, yeah, congratulations to Mrs. Rupert being the nominee for not only breeding but also owning Bright Duchess, the daughter of Duke of Marmalade. Fantastic win and comments both from trainer and jockey in that she will be quite progressive from here. Still a little bit green, but uh, more to come from number six, Bright Duchess. Yeah, well, JP, 